हमारे प्लीनरी सेशन के बारे में और भारत जोड़ो यात्रा के दूसरे चरण के बारे में और ज्यादा जा, जानकारी देंगे उसके बाद एक थीम सॉन्ग रिलीज होगा उसके बाद आप सभी को लंच का इन्विटेशन दिया गया है कैलेंडर भी रिलीज होगा और उसके बाद हम लोग सब लंच के लिए जाएंगे जो बिल्कुल बगल में ही है तो मैं वेणुगोपाल जी से गुजारिश करूंगा कि वो आपको संबोधित करें थैंक यू जयराम जी गुड आफ्टरनून टू एवरीबडी फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल वेरी हैप्पी न्यू ईयर टू ऑल आवर मीडिया फ्रेंड्स 2022 was most eventful year for i think all of you and especially for indian national congress we had a democratic election and congress president has elected through transparent democratic way as per the tradition we already announced the plenary session of the party on last leg of february at raipur now aicc has decided that the 85th plenary session of indian national congress will be held on 24 25 26 th of february at raipur it will th three day conference start from 24th and ending on 26th february there will be six major subject to be debated one is political economic international affairs farmers and agriculture social justice and empowerment youth education and employment these are the six subjects which are going to be debated and discussed in the plenary session along with a constitutional amendment usually we should do that constitutional amendment committee also that will also be there the part of this plenary session states and one union territory you are all know tamil nadu kerala karnataka andhra pradesh telangana maharashtra madhya pradesh rajasthan haryana and delhi most importantly sri rahul gandhi and the bharat yatris have been meeting interacting and conveying the message of bharat jodo yatra to tens of thousands of people of this country in each day this yatra is truly a listening exercise for congress party the yatra listen to the people A large number of meetings. So far, there have been seven, eighty-seven meetings. 
sitting interactions with 30, 40 minutes with various groups. Usually of 20, 30 people will be there in that interactions. You know, different level, farmers, youth, physically differentiated people, ex-servicemen, this type of the people from the various walks of the life are participated in these interactions. There have been 200 planned walks with the smaller groups of four or five people. That's from celebrity to intellectuals, to activists, to ex-servicemen, and to small kids. In addition to this, there have been uncounted people from different walks whom Sri Rahul Gandhi has greeted and walked with during this walk, Yatra. To convey the message of the Yatra, there have been 95 corner meetings where Rahul Gandhi make a 20 minute, 20, 25 minute short speech about the message of Yatra and the current political scenario. In addition, 10 large public meetings have been held to which lakhs of people have been participated. You know that there have been also nine major press conferences by Rahul Gandhi, one in each state where media especially local media, are freely asked to questions. Again, the spirit of Bharat Jodo Yatra has been celebrated with visit to the several important religious places and spiritual centers. Interactions and performances by numerous artists and also two Bharat Jodo major concerts also. Through this yatra is a significant milestone created in the Congress party, rich tradition of representing the voice of all Indians. Yatra will continue from Delhi on January 3rd, walking through Uttar Pradesh from 3rd to 5th, Haryana from January 6th to 10th again. Punjab from January 11 to 20th and in between 19 we are spending in Himachal for a day. The Yatra will enter Jammu and Kashmir on the evening of the 20th and end with a flag hosting at Srinagar, on Srinagar on the 13th of January. 30th of January, 30th of January. The meeting of Bharat Jodo is not limited only to the 12 states. You all, all know. We had a parallel Bharat Jodo Yatra already Assam completed 8, 9, 895 kilometer Bharat Jodo Yatra. Jharkhand completed thousands of kilometer Bharat Jodo Yatra. Now Bihar is starting tomorrow on 5th. And of course, West Bengal is also doing Bharat Jodo Yatra of West Bengal. All these activities, we are conveying the message of Bharat Jodo Yatra to the common people of this country. And January 26 onwards, for two months, Hath Se Hath Jodo Abhayan is going to create a clear-cut follow-up of this Bharat Jodo Yatra by doing thousands of corner meetings in the local areas of this country. Dear brothers, the major achievement of this Yatra, you people ask, it actually is a Unite India exercise, United India exercise by the Congress party. You all know how many people participated in this Yatra. Basically, this Yatra united people in its own unique way. We can give you numbers. 
but you cannot measure the unity factor through numbers. You cannot measure the unity factor through kilometers. The Jodo element of Bharat Jodo Yatra can be measured in the happy tears people have shed while hugging Rahul Gandhi. The people who are interacting with Rahul Gandhi, you can see, then you can see the face of that particular person who interacted with Rahul Gandhi. From the rise, you can see the united India efforts of this Bharat Jodo Yatra. In that way, we are very confident and we are happily, we can say that the message of Bharat Jodo Yatra has been successfully established. This is the major element of success of this Yatra. Of course, BJP, Sankhvarivar, all others are trying to attack this Yatra. 24 into 7, they have only one point agenda to attack Rahul Gandhi and this Yatra through social media, through fake messaging system. But we are very confident that in whatever level of amount they are doing all this exercises to damage Rahul Gandhi and this Yatra, more than that amount, we are getting positive response from the people of this country. You see that we have wrote two letters to the Home Minister of the country about the security aspects. That letter is in the public domain. Whenever a party, national party, which ruled the country for so many years, writing a letter to the Honorable Home Minister of India, at least someone can expect a reply from the Home Minister himself. Or otherwise, at least his junior minister reply. Instead of that, one DIG has replied to us, which is totally in false. We raised two, three concerns in, through that letter. You know that. IB people searched our, one of our container. We had filed an FIR in Haryana state. We mentioned that. There was no reply on that factor. Jairam Damasti so many times raised the issue of intelligence bureau is trying to interrogate the people who interacted with Rahul Gandhi. There is no reply on that. And total coordination failure of Delhi police on 24th. You are all there, media people are all there. We raised the concern to the Delhi police authorities that day itself. Nothing had happened. That also don't reply by the home ministers or any of the officers. We have a complaint against uh, security arrangements. We had a, given a complaint against security people. The same security people replying to us. What logic is it? In democracy, at least an, um, um, as per the, as per the uh, parliamentary conventions, whenever a member of parliament is writing, not even a party, a member of parliament is writing a letter to a minister, there should be an answer from the minister itself. This is the convention which we are going through. So, now we are going to Punjab and Kashmir. We are not scared about anything. But it is our, I, we think that it is our duty to point out the shortcoming of the security arrangement by the authorities. That is what we have done. We, 
finally some of the media has given good coverage for bharat jodo yatra some of them are totally neglected this yatra <laughs> we are very much thankful to the media people those who are advising congress party for the future endeavors but at the same time we are expecting some positive coverage for this yatra also after the independence basically before the independence mahatma gandhi ji had done dandi yatra but since independence which political party has done this type of massive exercise with huge participation first of all the observation beginning observation was oh, maybe it, it will be, it may be success it might be successful in tamil nadu or in kerala but it will fail in karnataka i can remember that whenever you people some of the people are there witness in raichur and bellari uh, padyatra of bharat jodo yatra amazing you can see that lakhs of people participated in that yatra on that days then andhra pradesh even though our party structure is very weak the response of towards the bharat jodo yatra from andhra pradesh also highly appreciated telangana maharashtra madhya pradesh one thing i have to tell you that 70 percentage of the people who participated in yatra are below 35 years young india take this yatra into their hearts women's participation you can see the videos same way in the same way farmers small and medium business people like all walks of life participated in large extent that is yatra basically when we are starting for the second leg of the yatra tomorrow Indian National Congress is very confident that the message of yatra is reach the common people of this country that type of change we can witness from the minds of the people of this towards this yatra i think in coming days we are all inviting you for next leg of the yatra culminating at kashmir i think january 30th rahul gandhi will host national flag in srinagar we are inviting all of you also to be part of that great event thank you shukriya vinay kumar ji abhi hum 2023 ke jo calendar aapko bhi mil jayega main vinay kumar ji se guzarish karunga wo isko bhi le sakte भारत जोड़ो यात्रा के आधार पर कैलेंडर <laughs> शुक्रिया अभी तीन मिनट का थीम सॉन्ग है थीम गीत है जो दूसरे भाग के लिए तैयार किया गया है सारणिक
आज के जो सुप्रीम कोर्ट का निर्णय है नोटबंदी के बारे में उस उस पर मेरे तरफ से पार्टी की ओर से वक्तव्य आ चुका है चिदम्बरम जी ने भी उस पर टिप्पणी की है अगर आपको कोई सवाल है उसके बारे में पवन खेरा जी है आपको बाद में बाइट दे सकते हैं अभी लंच का वक्त हो रहा है पर आपको जो सवाल करने हैं वेणुगोपाल जी से आप कर सकते हैं हाँ वो करेंगे पहले आप वेणुगोपाल जी से सवाल पूछेगा या फारूक अब्दुल्ला जी महबूब मुफ्ती जी ऑल आर एग्री टू बी पार्ट ऑफ भारत जोड़ो यात्रा इन जम्मू एंड कश्मीर Yeah, actually, we met uh, Lieutenant Governor also one week before. We had a very good discussion. He all offered all sort of helps and support for the yatra. We we didn't expect anything from him, bad thing from him. No, no, from Rahul Ji side, it's. Uh, we have sent letters to the major political party last day 24th also lot many people from other part political party member of parliaments joined in the yatra whenever we are going to not it is not for tomorrow only coming days whomever want to participate let them participate that's what i think some people will join we send the political parties no we didn't start this, this is a, as a political yatra this thing we basically told rahul gandhi himself told congress party told this yatra is beyond political we are taking the issue of country like unemployment price rise then divisive politics of bjp these are the main slogans of this yatra but certainly this is this will become a political movement certainly this type of yatra will become a, now i think this this yatra become a political movement certainly every program will have an impact on a political party but obviously this program is much of the biggest program which congress party and any other political party have done in this country there will be electoral impact also that definitely but our motive is to to make electoral impact through this yatra this is not our motive very clearly we told but naturally the benefit will come for the party yes arun peru gopal ji abhi kal parso tak akhilesh yadav keh rahe the mujhe koi nahi nimantran mila bharat jodo par aaj wo rahul gandhi ko chutti dikh ke dhanyawad de rahe unko ki aapko dhanyawad aapne mujhe invite kiya aur shubhkamna aapki yatra ke liye ek to ye hai why this sudden change of heart ye kaise hua tha iske piche aur dusra jo unhone pucha tha gulam nabi azad ko aapne mere saath kya discussion ki unki political party ki that is what initially i told at least see some positive notes from our side question is only on negative way because akhilesh yadav told good things for this you rely upon that why you are taking the earlier statement basically you have to rely upon this latest statement which is very much positive on bharat jodo yatra we are we are we are respecting that sentiments of akhilesh yadav ji certainly Yeah. Yeah. We told the the yatra beginning is anybody who are totally along with the idea of Bharat Jodo Yatra can join in the yatra.
इस प्रेस कॉन्फ्रेंस के विषय से संबंधित नहीं है प्लीज प्लीज आप अलग अलग सवाल बाद में पूछे Certainly, the, the, yeah, certainly we had a fruitful discussion with the Chief Minister of Punjab also. I met him personally to discuss about the security arrangement of Punjab. And we wrote a letter to the Home Minister of the country regarding Punjab and Kashmir. I think there will not be any problem. I don't think. Exactly. I think today morning the uh, Delhi police is uh, having a meeting with our people, organizers of Delhi, uh, PC, Delhi DPCCs. I think uh, we, we we are expecting a good response from the Delhi police, better response from than 24th tomorrow. We told our people already. We told our people about this police uh, issues, and I think our people will also will be ready for that. मन में डर नहीं है भैया दिस यात्रा स्टार्ट फ्रॉम कन्याकुमारी दिल्ली तक यात्रा वेंट ऑन वेरी वेल वी आर नॉट द पीपल हु आर स्केरिंग ऑल दिस थिंग्स डोंट थिंक दैट बट वी थॉट दैट इट इज आवर ड्यूटी टू इनवाइट द अटेंशन ऑफ द यूनियन मिनिस्ट्री यूनियन स्पेशली यूनियन होम मिनिस्ट्री एंड द स्टेट अथॉरिटीज वी आर रेडी टू कॉपरेट विद द सिक्योरिटी फोर्सेस we are ready to cooperate with the government for security arrangements this is what we have done we didn't have any the don't, the, don't think that we didn't have any scare we are we are totally courageous our leader is totally courageous you know him if bishop bishop we 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 have given invitation to like minded political party heads Yeah. That you will get a new uh, separately. Don't worry about that. Please, one one person, one question. One nation, two fathers. Then everything they have to depend upon Supreme Court verdict. Then. we have clear cut already our party position has already has given we are very much firm that demonetization is actually done against the common people of this country we are still standing on that front that also we have already told if the government of india are coming with a guideline supported by experts and who Then we will think about that. Last question. It will be a great success. You can see Uttar Pradesh three days. साथियों अभी आपको लंच इंतजार कर रहा है पर एक चीज मैं बता दूं, स्पष्ट कर दूं, सुप्रीम कोर्ट का निर्णय सिर्फ नोटबंदी के प्रक्रिया पर है परिणाम पर नहीं अगर माफी मांगनी है किसी को प्रधानमंत्री को मांगनी है क्योंकि 8 नवंबर 2016 को जो उन्होंने तुगलकी निर्णय लिया लाखों एमएसएमई का विनाश हुआ 
इनफॉर्मल सेक्टर का विनाश हुआ लाखों परिवारों की रोजगार गई और हमारे अर्थव्यवस्था पर जो नकारात्मक असर हुआ आज भी हम भुगत रहे हैं अगर माफी मांगनी है सो कॉल्ड फादर ऑफ न्यू इंडिया को मांगना है ओके थैंक यू वेरी मच प्लीज ज्वाइन अस